Like most holidays, Halloween will be a little different this year thanks to COVID-19. Fox 44's Emily K spoke with health officials and shows us how we can keep ourselves safe while trick-or-treating this year. Emily? Noelle, there are a lot of ways you can keep your family safe during Halloween this year, and they can be as easy as filling a plastic baggie with candy like this. Halloween is right around the corner and due to COVID-19, there are some extra precautions you may want to take. This year we do have the added aspect of COVID, so that's something that I do want people to keep in mind. If you plan on trick-or-treating, health experts suggest you maintain the social distancing guidelines. Wear a mask. I have my Halloween mask today. So wear your mask. This is the season for mask and a cloth mask is what you need, not the mask that you buy at the store or anything like that. When you think about trick or treating, you know, some people like to go in large groups, make your group smaller, just your own people that live in your home. You should also limit the number of places you go trick or treating this year. And for those who are handing out candy, the big communal um, trick or treat bowl where people would just grab candy, that needs to change. Consider individual little goodie bags. They don't have to be fancy. It can be just as simple as a Ziploc bag. But that idea of everyone reaching into the same candy bowl is really not a good idea. Um, keep a distance, maybe set up a little table or something outside of your door where you can keep that six foot of distance where they can come get their candy. You can see them, but you're still apart. And then of course, if you're handing out candy, you too need to wear a mask as well. And of course, the usual trick or treating safety measures still apply. Be aware of candy that appears to have been tampered with. Don't let kids go out alone and remember to carry a flashlight or wear something reflective once the sun goes down. You want to make sure that your children and yourself are very visible uh, to vehicle traffic. Those are heavily traveled roads. So we want to make sure that uh, that we can avoid any type of unnecessary um, you know, collisions between vehicles and pedestrians. The CDC recommends that you wear a cloth mask instead of a typical Halloween mask, and Waco PD suggests that you sanitize your candy wrappers before opening them. Live in the newsroom, Emily Kay, Fox 44 News.